Hello Sagittarius, I'm giving you a reading for April 2018. It's a general reading. It applies to singles and couples, however it comes out. Um, I asked the universe to give me uh, the people that need to hear it the most. The energies out there. Remember, this may not resonate with everybody. I need a reading for Sagittarius, April 2018. General reading for April in, two, in April 2018 for Sagittarius. April 2018, Sagittarius. Hope March has been treating you well, but April is coming up soon. April is headed our way. Already gave the Mercury and retrograde readings. Those are energies coming towards you. Six of Cups. Sagittarius may have someone coming back from the past, or you're thinking a lot about them. Remember, this may not resonate with everyone, or may resonate with a lot of people. New beginning there. Something ended in the past. Princess of Swords. Like I said, someone may come back, though. Something ended, but someone else may come back, or maybe that thing you thought was dead is coming back, or maybe you're just thinking a lot about it. But anyway, let's clarify some of these before we even get started. we got the Prince of Swords as a subject line and the Four of Swords. The Prince of Swords is reversed, and the Four of Swords is uh, crossing it, and it's in the upright, but it's still crossing the Prince of Swords. Now, the Prince of Swords can be an air element. It could be Aquarius, uh, uh, Libra, or Gemini. And it's like... They weren't, they're, they're in reverse, so they could be real abrupt, they, 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 they could speak without thinking, and when they say something, it cuts like a knife. Uh, but what's crossing them is taking a break. Maybe you're thinking about taking a break from them, maybe they're thinking about taking a break from you. These energies can get reversed, as you know. Well, why is the Prince of Swords there for Sagittarius in April? Why is the Prince of Swords in reverse and the four, four Swords crossing them? Why is it there? Avoiding a tower movement. So someone's taking a break to avoid a tower movement. A tower movement is when everything comes crashing down. I need another card for the Prince of Swords. Why is it there with the tower card and the Four of Swords? Why is it there? Hmm. Could have been when you went out celebrating, going out. Maybe you got angry, someone went out. Maybe uh, you went out, they went out. But something, maybe you had an argument. But something did end. I want to find out what that ending is. Something came to a dead halt. So, uh, why are you there, death card? Why are you there? Why is a death card in the past? Or Sag. Now someone didn't want to deal with a page of wands, possibly. Or someone that is just wanting a one-night stand, possibly. Something quick. Passionate, but quick. But not exactly what maybe somebody wanted and they ended it. They ended the situation. Because there was... Maybe they didn't want the competition. This is in reverse. When I see this, is like competitiveness. And maybe someone just didn't want to be in that type of situation. I don't know if this is your, your energy or somebody else's or combined. But what you got also here is the foundation is a new beginning. The full card taking a new beginning. Taking a step out to the wild unknown. Why are you there, full card? Why are you there? Because you uh, a judgment, making a sound judgment. You decided you're going to make a new beginning. Why else are you there? I needed another card for this. Full card, why are you there? Why are you there for Sagittarius? Why are you there for Sagittarius? Why are you there for Sagittarius? Full card, why are you there for Sagittarius? Queen of Pentacles. It's like someone's wanting their 
The Queen of Pentacles is someone who is stable, sound, upright. They're independent. They, uh, but they also at the same time help other people and take care of other people all the time. But this person I see as someone who has taken a new beginning. This could be your energy. Or it could be somebody else coming in because it's a new beginning with the Queen of Pentacles. And you make, you make a decision to do so. That's the foundation. Maybe this got, because this person came in, or maybe this is you, this energy got turned around and, and maybe you didn't want to deal with it, ended it with somebody else, and began it with somebody, or wanted to begin it with somebody else. That is a possibility, or this could be, like I said, a past partner doing this. But something definitely ended, and now something new is beginning. Now the goal is the Prince of Discs. This is also earthly type energy, just like the Queen of Pentacles. And I, met, I should mention that the, the, the Pentacles can be is an earthly element. It's Virgo, Capricorn, or Taurus. And that is a goal. So you may be looking to start something new with an earth sign. Or start something, a new beginning. Prince of Discs, why are you there? Prince of Discs, why are you there? Prince of Discs, why are you there? For April, for Sagittarius, why are you there as the goal? Yeah, someone's offering someone maybe a kindness, friendship, love, partnerships. It's an emotional type offer or a, a message of, uh, um, how can I say it? An emotional message of friendship or something a little bit more than friendship. This person can sometimes be young. And sometimes uh, a water element is attached to it. But usually when I see this, a page of cups, I see it as someone making some type of offer. But for some reason, you're nine of swords. You're, you're still upset about something that ended in the past. Maybe something to do with the air element, an air, per air sign possibly, or someone that acts like an air sign. Because in the uh, outcome, there's the princess of swords. That is an air, air sign. Just like I said earlier, it is at Aquarius, uh, Libra, Gemini. But they're in the upright in, when it's all said and done at the end of the month. Or it could be a totally different air sign. Why are you there, Princess of Swords? Why are you there? Why are you there in the future? And in April, why are you there is the outcome in April. Why are you there? Huh. I need another card. That's a Hermit card. This person is staying to themselves. Why are you there? I need another card for the Hermit card and the uh, Princess of Swords. Why are you there? Why are you there? Queen of Swords. I'm getting a lot of air energy in your chart. Someone's, uh, maybe this Queen of Swords after maybe an ending, this person is probably going to think to themselves maybe what occurred. Maybe they're going to turn themselves in the upright. But I see you possibly have two different options here. One, you're thinking about making a new beginning with somebody. That's my overall feel because something ended possibly with an air sign. But the air sign is still kind of there. They're kind of, you know, maybe going to be there towards the end of April. But they're not talking much, and they're not getting out much. Or you may not be talking to them. You may be thinking about them also. This could be you thinking about them, contemplating, thinking. And someone may get a little defensive, but I need a, a, a vice cards, two vice cards for Sagittarius, because this looks like an ongoing thing. What is going on for Sagittarius? It looks like they came out of a war. Can you give me advice for Sagittarius? Remember, the negatives with the vice card is for you to turn that around and make it a positive thing. And for a positive card or positive cards, you are to move forward with it. Don't throw a monkey wrench in it. But the advice card of the universe is, is, is basically giving you permission to change the situation. That's the way I look at it, and I use it on myself all the time, especially on advice. I need two cards of advice card for Sagittarius. Two cards of advice for Sagittarius for the month of April 2018. A vice card for Sagittarius. A vice card for Sagittarius. Hangman. 
Five of Cups. It's telling you to come out of sorrow, which you are. Hangman, and this is kind of, it can be either negative or positive. It could be telling you to hold back on decisions. Like that hermit card is a lot like that one. But it may tell you to wait or it's to stop waiting around. But I'm thinking it's telling you to stop having this heartache. Stop waiting around for this heartache. This is the Five of Cups reverse. That's a good card. That's someone coming out of uh, heartbreak. Sorrow. The Three Cups is spilt in front of them. And the Two of Cups is full behind them. They don't see the Two of Cups usually because they're crying over the Three of Cups. Not realizing they have two cups full. The vice is saying you're you're going to come out of sorrow. Don't hang around and wait for sorrow. Move on, and you will be getting over this situation. Whatever is going to happen, it's going to work out. You're going to be able to work it out in your head as the final outcome. As the vice is thinking. Is getting a little defensive, maybe this air sign. And the advice card, like I said, is don't have the sorrow and don't hang around for sorrow. Okay? Talk to you later, Sagittarius.